Hi, I'm Candace Copeland. Did you know that cross-training is one of the most effective ways to get into shape and stay healthy? Cross-training simply means variety, changing your activities from day to day or from week to week. The idea behind cross-training is to mix and match your workouts so you have variety to avoid boredom and you challenge your body in new ways. This step and low tape gives you two complete aerobic workouts. I've designed these workouts so that you're burning lots of fat and calories and you're also using your muscles in different ways. This helps you to balance your muscle strength and to reduce the risk of injury associated with performing the same activity every day. Workout one begins with a warm up and is followed by 30 minutes of fun step combinations. I'll give you suggestions on how to increase or decrease the intensity so the workout is perfect for your fitness level and your fitness goals. Workout two begins with a different warm up and is followed by 30 minutes of low impact combinations and then a cool down. You can choose to do either the step or low impact workout today or combine both of them for a longer challenge. Let's take a minute now and go over some important safety guidelines. The most important rule is to work out at a level that feels comfortable for you. You want to use a step height that feels good and remember if you're in doubt, lower is probably better. Throughout the workout, we'll use perceived exertion checks to monitor your intensity. This means you stay in tune with how you're feeling. You should feel like you're working a little harder than is comfortable, but not so hard that you have to stop. If you can talk in short sentences, that's a good indicator that you're working at an effective level. So when I ask you how you're doing, go ahead and talk back to me. In both workouts, I'm going to give you the option of power movements or propulsion movements to increase the intensity. I recommend that you get familiar with these routines first and then gradually add them in. Progress slowly at a pace that feels good to you. Finally, I want you to drink lots of water throughout the workout. Don't wait until you get thirsty. Staying hydrated can make a big difference in your performance and it's really important for your overall good health. So now, are you ready to burn some calories and have some fun? Let's start with a good warm up. March behind your step. Okay, make sure you have plenty of space around you. Let's step touch to the side. Good, about step width apart is about how wide you want to step. Now let's grapevine. Circle the arm. Grapevine side to side. Let's do it again. And again, now we're going to add on to this. Grapevine, now tap the step two times. That's it, do it again. Tap it up. Grapevine. Tap it up. Fine. Okay, we're going to go back to that step touch. So it's side. We do four step touches. Now a grapevine. Tap it up. So that's our little combination. Step touch. Side to side. Good. Grapevine. Step touch. Do it again. Now really get those legs going up and down so we get them nice and warm. Grapevine. Tap it up. Yeah. Feel yourself getting a little warmer, heart rate going up. Now, step touch. We're going to add on this time. New move. Grapevine. Tap it up. Now, squat side. Do it again. Now, four little side steps the other way. Right back to where you started. Here comes the step touch. Take it out. Grapevine. Tap. Now, squat side. Take it from the top. Step touch. Looking good. Grapevine. Tap. And squat. Press. Remember, you're stepping out about shoulder width apart. Now side. Little steps. One more time. Step touch. Grapevine. Take it over. Tap it up. Reach and pull. Now squat. Press. Pull. And side step. Okay, we're going to hold it here. March right next to your step. March here on the side of the step. Now let's mambo forward and back. That looks good. Now march again. Have a little fun with it. And mambo. Okay, we're going to hold it right here. Take that inside leg, place it on the step. Find your balance. Press up on this leg. Slow. Tap it out. Now a little faster. Side and tap. That's it. 
Now make sure you press all the way up on the step. You're not kicking the leg, you're swinging. Feel real balanced. That's it. Two more of these. Now we're going to take that leg to the back, just like this. Back, now lift the knee. Up and down. Good. Make sure those abs are really, really tight. Now press the heel down and lift so it's not a kick with the back leg, a nice lift. We're going to hold it right here and ease into a hamstring stretch, a calf stretch, holding it. Are your abs pulled in tight? Breathe, relax. Now place the foot on the step, toes go in and out, arms come up and down. Lift up and down and lift, so just tapping those toes, warming up the shin, the ankles. Last two, place the leg up and down. Now round the back, getting a little stretch in the low back. Slide the feet together and march right here. Come on around to the side of your step. Let's mambo. Yeah. And march. Sit, you're right on the side of the step. Mambo. Okay, we're gonna hold it here. Place the foot on the step. Find your balance. We're gonna press up on your inside leg. You lift and down. Tap now a little faster. It's up. Tap down. Side. Good. Again, remember that balance. You want to lift all the way up to the pause on the top. It's up. Two more times. Now take that leg to the back. Here we go. Lift back. Now lift the knee. As you rock back and forth, you still maintain that really good posture. Now back, heel dig. Place it out. Good. Two more. One more. Now hold it here. Here's that stretch. Easing down into that hamstring stretch. Flex the foot back to add in the calf muscle. Stomach muscles tight for four and three. And two foot on the step. Tap the toes. In and out. Here's your arms. Side to side. Good. Up and down. Tap the toes. Two more. One more. Now here's that brush side. Brush it up. Side. Round the back. Nice and easy. One more. Slide the feet together. Let's break fine. Here we go. Are you guys getting warm? How about you? Okay. Let's add on. It's side. Tap up, tap down. Right here with a little heel dip. Break fine. Tap up, tap down. Looks good. Great right find. Tap up. Heel dig. Great right find. Okay, we're going to add on again next time. Listen up. Two repeaters. It's one. Now lunge back. Tap up. Great right find. Heel dig up. Two repeaters. One. Two. Lunge back. Tap it up. That's it. Let's do it again. Good. Two repeaters. Up. Lunge back, remember you just tap the toe. Great find. Tap it up. And repeat. Lunge back, tap. Now let's do it one more time through on each side. Heel up. Repeat or pull it all the way up on the step. Here we go. Yeah. And repeat her. Lunge back. Hold it here and march it out. Great job. That's the end of our warm up. Let's get ready to step. Here we go. I've designed this workout so that you can progress at your own pace. If you want an easier workout without any propulsion moves, I want you to watch Steve and Sharon. If you want a little bit higher intensity workout with propulsion movements, you can watch Robin, Marshall, and myself. Let's start with an alternating knee up. Here we go. Now we're going to keep this knee up going, but we're going to travel side to side. Keep the shoulders and hips facing front, and you take a wide step to get to the other side. Now let's add on here. Let's do three more of these knee ups. Lunge back. Here's the third one. Now the fourth one changes sides. That's it. Let's try it again. Knee up, lunge back, but keep your chest up as you reach back with the leg. Here's the one that changes sides. And here's some arms. Reaching over. Sit. Now the arms go front as you change sides. And knee up. Take it back. That's it. And the arms go front. Now this time on the third one, here's a surprise. You get to go off the side. Ready? 
And now back on the step, change sides. Like that? Okay, let's try it again. Here we go, off the side. And back on. And again, up. Now, if you want to add a propulsion, you can hop as you go off the side. Remember, it's optional. It's up. Reach back. That's it. And up. Side. And up. Now, we're going to add on again. This time, after we go off the side, let's add a grapevine right across the front. Let's go back the other way. Back onto the step. Now, a V step. Right here, do it again. Two Vs from the top. Knee up, lunge back. That's it. Off the side. Great find. And up. Back on the step. Two V steps. You punch it out. Good. From the top. Knee up. Remember the propulsions are optional. You can hop. Right there. Back on. V step. And from the top. And back. Here we go. Off the end. Great find. It's looking good. Come back. Back on the step. V step. Okay, one more time through. Ready? Here we go. Lunge back. Good posture off the side. Great find. And back. And back on the step. Here's that V step. Good. Stay close to your step. From the top. Lift it up. You don't want to get too far away from the step. Off the side. Because then it's hard to get back on. And maintain good body alignment. Take it up. Last time. V step. All right. Stay here. Knee up. Right here. That looks good. Now we're going to travel side. Quarter to corner. The arms are going to go up. Right here. Looking good. And again. All right, let's add on here. One knee up. Now a basic step front. The arms open. Good. And the arms open. How are we doing? Good. All right, are you guys ready to add on again? All right, knee up to the corner. This time we're going to march on the step in a wide V position. Hold it up. Now march on the floor. Other side, knee up. Good, so we get a wide V. Here we go. It's up and down. Now, if you want to add a propulsion, you can either do the V or you can do the pendulum right here. So you leap up on the step. Take it up. Basic. V or pendulum. Watch where you're leaping if you do that propulsion movement. Take it up. Basic. Take it up. Good. Now one more time. I want you to remember this because we're going to come back to this. We're going to put together a long combination. Take it up. And down. Now knee up to the corner. Other side. This is part two of our combination. All right. Let's do a three count repeater. Hold it right here. Other side. Take it up. Now watch our feet. You're going to go knee. Now heel. Now back. Change sides. Knee, it's just a little heel tap on the front edge of the step. Take it up. Tap. And tap. And up. Looking good. Let's add on again, okay? Here we go. We're going to do two ankle taps. Face front. Ankle tap here. Ankle tap here. Repeater. Remember, you want to lift the body all the way up on the repeaters. Ankle tap. Good. Repeater. Woo. Tap down. It's a light tap down. You want to lift up tall. Tap down easy. Repeater. Tap down. Ankle tap. Now, let's take it from the top and put those together, okay? Knee lift. Here we go. Basic. Pendulum or V. Again, we'll do it on both sides here. Knee up. Basic. Pendulum or V. Okay, here comes the repeater. Ready? Take it up. Heel. And ankle tap. Good. And repeater again. Looking good. Now you should feel like your heart rate's starting to get up there. Nice, steady, continuous work. From the top, knee up. Curl it up. Basic, pendulum, or V, and 
and down. Other side. Up. Lift it. Pendulum V. Okay, here come the repeaters. Take it up. And down. Ankle tap. Pull it back. And repeater. Woohoo! All right, you guys ready to go on? Okay, stay here. Tap up, tap down. Face front. Tap up, tap side. Now, add a lift on this leg. Lift it up. Lift up. And here's some arms. You step. Oh, good. Now, remember, you don't want to kick that leg. You want to lift it with good posture. Let's do two of these. One and two. Now, a turn step. Turn. Basic step front. Hold it here. Tap up, tap down. Tap it up. Good. Just like we did. Now, make it a lift. Tap down. Here's the arms. Pull it up. Good. I like this step. How about you guys? Let's do two more. One and two. Turn step. And basic front. And again, side lift. We do two of these. Turn step. With or without propulsion, basic. Yes. And other side. So it just keeps alternating sides. Turn step. Basic. And side lift. And turn step. Basic. Last time. All right, you guys ready to go on? All right, new step. Basic. Lift to the back. Stay here. Lift back. Good. Now abs in tight. Arm circle. Let's do two of these, just like we did with the other one. One and two. Now a turn step. Basic step front. And lift back. You're on the other side. Fifth. Turn step. Basic. Let's do it again. So you get two lift steps. Abs in. Really tight. Turn. And basic. One more. Lift. All right, are you guys ready to take this whole thing from the top? Yeah? All right, from this corner, knee up. Basic. Pendulum or V. Take it up. And down. Now the repeater to this corner. Take it up. Really pull. And ankle tap. Side lift. Looking good. And turn step. Lift it up. Basic. Here's the lift back. That looks good. Now turn step. Turn step to the other side. From the top. Knee up. Basic. And V step or pendulum. And down. Repeater right here. And down. And ankle tap. Pull it back. Here's that side lift. Really strong. Up. And down. And turn. Basic. All right, lift back. Take it up. Good. Turn step. Let's take it from the top. Ready? Knee up right here. Woohoo! How we doing? V or pendulum. And repeat. Ankle tap. Take it back. Here's that side lift. My favorite step. Yeah. Turn step. Basic. Lift back. Woohoo! Turn step. Turn step. Last time through. Knee up. Here we go. All right, now you know it. Let's really do it. Pendulum or V. And down. Repeat. And down. Ankle tap. Pull it back. Now here's the side lift. Ready? Side lift. And down. Turn step. And basic, lift back, all the way up. Don't let it go now. Turn step, turn step, hold it here, tap up, tap down. Really good work. Woo, how do you feel? Let's go on with a new combination. Okay, we're gonna do one tap up, tap down. Now turn step, no arms, two knee ups right here. Knee up, let's do it again. Tap up, arms open, turn. Knee up, the arms punch. And punch. Tap up. Turn step. And knee up. Good. Get all the way up on that step. One more time. Then 
we're gonna make a little change to this. This is kind of a fun one. And lift it up. Now, next time, tap up, tap down, turn step into a straddle. Take it up right here. Now, knee up. Yes, now tap off the back of the step. Tap up, tap down. Turn step straddle. Oh, this is fun. And down. Tap down and tap up. Turn straddle. And knee up, really pull the body all the way up on that step. Tap down, tap up, tap down. And turn straddle, knee up. All right, we're gonna go on here. Hold it here, let's go over the top. It's up and down. And up and two more. The ankle or the heel taps across here. Now arms curl up and down and up. Good, with or without propulsion. Now let's march up on top of the step. Hold it, one, two, three, four, five, tap down. And one. That's it. Now we're gonna march off the end. Here we go. And up, tap down. March up, off the end. Now with the knee lift. Lift the knee, off the end. Lift the knee, tap down. This is a T step. Here's the arm. Gets up. Here we go. Good. So from now on, we'll call this a T-step. Two more times, it changes sides. Good. How you guys doing? Let's put it together over the top. Here we go. It's up and down and up. T-step. Yeah. Now over the top. Look at it, changes sides. How about that? And take it up, T. One more set. Over, up. Heel down. Really bend the knee up. When you bend the knee on that over the top, it makes you work a little harder. Bend. You have to lift them to get back up. Pull it up. Let's take this from the top. Tap up, tap down. Hold it up. Turn, straddle. Woo. Knee up. Pull it up. And over the top. Here we go. Towards me. And T-step. And up. Now you're on the other side of your step. Tap up, tap down. Turn, straddle. Tap up the front side of your step over the top. And up. Key steps. Yes. Last time, all the way through. Tap up, tap down. Turn straddle. Woo. Knee up. Tap off the back side of the steps over the top. Now bend. And knee up. Yes. And other side. Tap up. Turn straddle. Knee up. That's it. Tap off the front over the top. Up. And down. Knee straddle. T. And hold it here. Yes. March it out. Really good work. Now, let's take a perceived exertion check. How do you feel right now? Use the chart on the screen and make sure you're working at an appropriate level for you. All right, here we go with the second half of our step workout. You'll notice now that your step is turned perpendicular to your TV screen and that you're marching at the back end of your step. All right, first step, we're gonna start with a move that goes corner to corner. Are you ready? Here we go. Corner to corner, now over the top. Let's do tap up, tap down two times, traveling back. Let's do that again, to the corner, adding arms. The arms circle up and over. Now, tap up, tap down. Good, tap up and corner to corner. So it's a lift, now remember, the propulsion is optional. Tap up, do you have that? Here we go, corner. We're gonna change it a little bit. Let's do a U-turn. Turn, now turn the other way. Corner to corner. So we get a corner, over the top, and U-turn. Here we go, one more time, corner. All right, remember this now, all right? We're gonna come back to it. Let's stay here and go over the top. With or without propulsion, the arms reach and pull. Now, we're gonna add on here. We're gonna squeeze in two lunges. Hold it, lunge. Tap down, let's do it again. Hold it, lunge. So what you do is a half and over the top and you squeeze two lunges right in the middle there. It's up. Let's hold it down here and march. Eight counts, you march. Over the top with the lunges. 
That looks good. Let's march on the other side. Good. Pick those legs up over the top with the lunges. Now instead of a march, let's mambo. Remember that mambo? Do it again. Over the top, lunge. Press it out. And mambo. So we mambo twice. Forward and back. Over the top, lunge right here. Let's do it again. Mambo. Over the top. Now we're going to hold it here. We're going to go corner to corner the other way. Lift it up over the top. Now those U-turns, you remember it. U-turn, do it again. Let's go corner to corner again. So we're going to do a few of these. We want to make sure both sides of our body are balanced. And again, it's a lift. Or watch Steve and Sharon U-turn if you don't want to do the propulsion. Last time, it's up. Okay, are you guys ready to put this all together? Here we go. We're gonna mambo. Stay here two times. One more. Over the top of the lunge. Press it out. Now corner to corner, other way. Lift over the top. U turn. We've got it. Other way. Mambo. Looking good. Okay, get ready for the corner to corner. Here we go. And over. You turn, remember, you've got to stay close to your step. Mambo. Otherwise, you have to kind of dive at that step to get on. Over the top with a lunge. And we don't want to do that. Corner to corner. Last time. You turn. And mambo. Press it out. And over the top. Now we're going to stay over on this side. Hold it here. Tap up, tap down. Right here. Instead of a tap up, let's lift the heel and lift the knee. Here's the arms. This is called a rocking horse. Press it out. One more of these, now we're going to do a side lift. Ready? Rocking horse again. So you do three of these, and two, and three. Side lift. Now let's go on. Four repeaters right here. Two. Stay with me. Now straddle down. Do it again. Now we're going to lunge side to side right here. We'll do this again, don't worry. Three more. Let's tap down right here. Now rocking horse. Heel up, knee up. Two, and three, side lift, and heel up. That looks good. Remember to keep those abs in on the rocking horse. Side lift, now four repeaters. Count them, one, two, three. Straddle down, and up again. Here we go with the lunges, hits down. Two, three, tap the toe, three more. Tap down on this side, rocking horse. You got it. Woo! One set of these, now side lift. Let's do two repeaters. It's one, one straddle down, three lunges. One and two, we're gonna tap down right here, rocking horse. Oh, that looks so good. My heart rate's getting up there, how about you guys? Lift. Two repeaters, one, two, straddle down, and lunge, one, tap down, let's do it again. Now if you want to add a propulsion, you can add it as you lift up. Yes, that makes it a lot harder. Side lift, two repeaters, straddle, and lunge, press down, tap down one more time, rocking horse, and up, and up. Two repeaters, here we go. Straddle. You guys ready to take it from the top? Tap down, corner to corner. Here we go. Woo! Over the top. U turn. We do two of these. Here comes the mambo. Yes, relax, breathe here. Over the top, lunge, push it. Rocking horse. It's up. Side lift. Two repeaters. Straddle. Lunge down. Now we're going to tap down on this side, corner to corner. Yes, over the top. U turn. Make sure you do two of them. Mambo, otherwise you'll be facing the wrong way. And over the top, lunge. Rocking horse. Here we go, with or without propulsion. Straight up. Abs in, side lift, and 
repeater two times. Straddle, lunge, get ready, tap down right here, corner to corner, here we go. Good work, you turn, up. Mambo, here's where you get to breathe. Did you breathe? And over the top. Tap down, now rocking horse. Lift, and up. Good, really strong, good posture, side lift. Two repeaters. Straddle, and lunge, down. Tap down on this side, last time through, corner. Woo! You guys can talk though, right? Mambo, catch our breath here. Okay, I got it. Over the top, lunge. Here we go, last time, rocking horse, pump it. Woo! That's it, side lift, two repeaters. Straddle, and lunge, down. We're gonna tap down here, hold it, tap up, tap down. With a heel. Oh ho! Get your breath. Two more. Okay, now, we're gonna take this front, let's alternate it back. Now, we're gonna hold it front two times. That looks good, take it front. One front, alternate. Good, heel up front one more time stay front alternate back to front now we're gonna get to the other side here's how we do it a five count repeater count them one two three over the top hold it here heel Woo! good that one gets your heart rate up and up all right let's go heel front heel back we're alternating now two heel fronts Looking good. One more, heel front, heel back, heel front. Okay, we're gonna do it one more time. We're gonna put this together. It's front, we're gonna go back and forth. Take it up. Are you ready for that repeater? Here we go, count it. One, two, three, four, five, over. Now, heel front, heel back, heel front, stay here for two. All right, here's that repeater, let me hear it. One, I wanna hear you too. Three, four, five, over the top. Woo, heel front, up, and back. Heel front, stay here for two. All right, here it comes, five of them. One, two, three, four, five, over the top. Now hold it here, march up on top of your step. Hold it up. Now we're gonna tap down, ready? Tap down, march up again. Ready, tap down. Now march up and straddle down, right here. Other side, we march up, straddle, march up, and tap down. So this is called a straddle over. That's what we'll call it from now on. Okay, you guys ready to add on to this? It's up and down and up. Now hold it here, kick to the corner. Now lift your knee and straddle over. Bend the knees down, kick to the corner, Straddle over, here we go. It's up and down. Kick to the corner, knee lift. Get ready, one more straddle over. It's up and kick and knee. Now we're gonna add on again, straddle over and it's a kick. Now we're gonna do two turn steps, no arms. Come to me, now back the other way. Let's go over the top. Side lift, right here. Turn step again towards me. Here's the arms. As you do a side lift, let the leg go side. And up. Good, turn step. Turn step, over the top, side lift. Side lift again. Turn step. Turn step. Side lift. Side lift again, one more set through. Turn step. Good, make sure that's nice and wide, over the top, side lift, again, last time through. Turn, and turn, over the top, lift it up, side lift on the straddle over, here we go, straddle, putting it all together now. Kick to the corner, knee lift, turn step, curl it up, and down. Over the top, lift, 
side lift. Now remember that heel dig front. Here we go. Heel front. Alternate it back. Woohoo! Two front. Stay here. What's coming up? Five repeaters. One, two, three, four, five. Over the top. Straddle over from the top. Here we go. That looks good. Kick to the corner. Knee up. Now turn step. Come towards me. And back. Over the top with a lift. And side lift. Now heel front. That's it. Heel back. And hold it front for two. Reach back. Now here it comes. Five of them. Three, four, five. Over the top. Straddle over. It's up. Bend the knees. Here's that kick. Kick now. Knee lift. Lift it up. Turn step. Open the legs wide. Over the top with a lift, side lift, and heel front. Push it out, heel back, front, hang on here, stay here. Repeater, let me hear it. One, two, three, four, five. Over the top, last time, straddle over. Woo. Kick it out, knee up, and turn step. Turn step, now over the top. Here's that lift, side lift, and heel front. All right, you're almost done. Hold it here. All right, five repeaters. Let me really hear it. One, two, this is the last one. Four, five, over the top. Hold it here, march it out. Great work. All right, but you're not done yet. If you're finished with your workout, the cool down is coming up. If you want to continue on with the low impact workout, stay tuned for the warm up. All right, if you're just joining us today, let's get warmed up. If you're finishing your workout for today, stay with this rhythmic movement until you're cooled down. And if you're continuing on to the low impact workout, this is a nice little recovery interval for you for you to catch your breath before we push it again. Okay, let's mambo forward. Let's march on the left foot, same thing. March eight counts, and mambo forwards. You reach and pull. Other leg, change. And mambo. Gain size. Good, pick up those legs, and mambo. And other leg. Now we're gonna add on to this, okay? So stay on this side, mambo. We're gonna step touch, side. That's it, now just bend the arms, curl it up. Let's go march on the other leg. March, here comes that mambo. Forward and back, step touch, that's it. Now we curl the arms, to curl. Good, change legs. All right, forward and back, pull it in. Step touch, now we're gonna make a little change here. Let's circle the step touch four times. One, two, and other leg, march. And forward and back. Step touch, bend those knees, circle. Oh, that looks good, march. Mambo. Step touch. Here we go with the circle. Yes. And march. All right. Forward and back. Step touch. Remember the body goes up and down. Now circle. You step tap. Rush. Now, next time, we're going to add on here again. You ready for more? Mambo. Don't forget any of this. Step touch. Circle. All right, stay on this side. We're gonna grapevine. Here we go. Stay here, two taps. Now four step touches. One and two. March on your other leg. Mongo. Step touch. Sit. Circle. All right, you ready for a grapevine? Here we go. Side, watch the arms. They push front with the leg. Now step touch four times. And march. Give me the beat. Here we 
Here we go. Forward. Step touch. Circle. And around. We like this move. Great find. All right, one little change here. We're going to do a step touch. Now scoot side. You can do it either with propulsion. March. And forward. Step touch. Remember, all the movements that are going to be done without propulsion today, circle, are done by Steve and Sharon, right over here. Great find. Touch, scoot. One more time through. We march. Forward and back. Scoop it out. Step touch. And circle turn. Great find. Push it out. Step touch, scoot, here we go. Mambo, and forward. Step touch, circle. Great find, stretch it out. Push it out, step it out, scoot. All right, hold it here, mark. Now, watch my feet, they're gonna go out, out, in, in. Now, watch that leg. It's going to come behind a little bit. Add some arms. We punch and down. Punch and reach. So you're shifting that weight from leg to leg. Let's get four more and three more. Last two. Now we're going to do a side lift. Watch. Side tap back. Side lift. Now it's not a big kick. Again, just shifting the weight, getting those muscles good and warm. Or cool down. Two more. Now rock forward and back. Tap the toe. Tap the heel. Tap the heel. Now we're going to pull the knee through. Punch the arm. Front and down. Pull the knee. Remember the abs stay in, the back stays up. Now let's turn to the corner. Add up. We're going to do two more of these. Now hold it right here. Take the leg down. Flex the foot. And we're going to just a nice, easy stretch all the way down the back of the leg, from the hamstring right through the calf. Hold it. Breathe. Abs are in. Now bring the feet together. Round the back up. And down. Little arch. So you round, stretch the back, stretch the front of the body. Round it. And down one more time. Now roll it up. And march. Other leg. March out, out, in, in. Open and close. Now let this leg start to come behind. Good. Two more. Are you ready with that punch with the arms? Here we go. And punch. And reach. Good. Open. Push back. Do so you feel that weight shift side to side? We're going to do a move like this in a little bit. Get ready. Side lift. Tap back. Side tap back. Good. Four more times. Remember, you want to feel balanced as you lift up. The abs always stay pulled in nice and tight. Get ready. Rock forward. Rock back. Forward. Heel back. Good. Now pull the knee through. Punch. That's it. Knee through. Good. Now we're going to turn to the corner. Ready? Pull. Good posture. Two more. And hold it here. Take the leg out, flex the foot. Again, easy, and this should be an easy, easy stretch. Don't push to the point where you feel a lot of tension or any pain. Hold it, abs are in, chest is up. And feet together right here, round the back. Oh, it feels good, and so we round the spine. We extend the spine. Roll it up, and one more time. Last time, roll it up, and march it out right here. Good work. Let's get ready for our first slow impact workout. Let's start out by marching. Now we're going to step touch to the side. Good. Bend those legs up and down so you really get a good workout. Now let's take the heel down across. Sit. All right. I'm going to change the arms a little bit. They go down two times. Now up two times. And down. Up, kind of like a bow and arrow. Down. And up. One more. Now we're going to travel. Let's move back. Down. And up. 
Now step touch forward, no arms. And travel back, heel back. And down. Now we're gonna add some arms next time we come forward. And the arms scoop up, up. Next time, if you want to increase the intensity, you can add a propulsion as you come forward, right here. Step. Now, if you don't want to do any propulsions, watch Steve and Sharon over here. They're going to do the low impact version the whole time. Take it up. One more time. It's down. And it's up. All right, going on, let's break fine to the side. Just relax here. This is a little holding pattern. Good. Remember, you want to lunge into the grapevine. Let's get two more now. Here comes a new step. It's a lunge kick. Watch. Lunge kick. Lunge kick. You lunge kick, step back. Let's add some arms. They circle up. They'll help you lift. And lift. Let's get four more. Do we have that? This is about the trickiest step in this whole routine. Let's go on, lunge kick, stay here, step kick. And lunge kick, step kick, step tap, lunge kick. Step kick, lunge kick. All right, let's go on again next time. Step kick, stay here, step touch, four times. Other side, lunge kick, step kick. And step touch. Looks good. And step. Step kick. Step touch. One more. Lunge kick. Step kick. Step touch. Let's start it with the grapevine. Here we go. Lunge kick. Step kick. Now one step touch. Hold it. Grapevine the other way. Lunge kick. Step kick. Step touch. Great find. We have it. Step kick. Step touch. Great find. And up. Step kick. And let's take it from the top. Heel back. Arms up. Now scoop forward. Yes. Great find. Lunge kick. Step kick. Step touch. Now heel back. Other side. Arms up. Scoop it up. Great find. Lunge kick. Step kick. Step touch. Heel back. Woo! Here we go. Forward. Great find. Lunge kick. Step kick. Here's that one step touch. Heel back. Other side. And scoop it up. Great find. Lunge. Step kick. Step touch. Now great find side. Here's our little holding pattern. We're gonna go on. You ready for more? Okay, let's get four more of these. You can just relax here for a second. Two more. We're gonna slide side. Cross front. Slide. Slide. Up. Let's get four more. This one gets your heart rate up. We're going to add on. Now, stay here. Tap side, cross back. Slide. Front, side, back. Slide. Front, side. Slide. Oh, we like that. Let's do a few more. And slide. Two more. Really stretch the legs out. You kind of lunge into that. So you get a big, powerful lift. Ready to add on? Okay, we're gonna stay here, tap front and back. Now rock front and back, quick. Slide. And tap front, quick. Slide. And rock, tap. Rock. Let's get a couple more. Push. One more. And rock. Let's go back to that grapevine. Here we go. Woohoo! Here we go. Now I'm going to change the arms here. One 
one arm up, other arm up, one at a time. Up, up, down, down. Let's get four more, three more, two more. Now we're gonna add on next time. Hold it here, step touch, two times. Great bond, one arm, step touch. Great bond, two step touches. Great bind, okay, should we add on again? Okay, great bind. Step touch, now knee lift, four times, pull it down. Side, great bind, and out. And pull it down. And great bind. And pull it down. One more. Woo. And pull it down. Okay, march it out. Now, are you ready to put that all together? Yes, we're gonna start with the heel back. Ready, here we go. Heel, arms up, scoop forward. Yes, right behind side, lunge kick, step kick, step touch, side slide. Woo, tap front and back, rock it out. Right behind, one arm, step touch, knee lift four times. Heel back, other leg. Heel, woohoo! Scoop it out. Right bind. Lunge kick. Step kick. Step touch. Side slide. And tap. Rock. Right bind. Step touch. Knee lift. Here we go. Take it back. Heel back. check. How do you feel right now? Use the chart on the screen and make sure you're working at an appropriate level. Here we go with the second half of our workout. Now we're going to start this with a grapevine traveling side. Here we go. Clap it out. All right, let's add a little knee lift on the end of the grapevine. Pull the knee side. Pull it up. Now we're gonna add on two more knee lifts. Right here in front. Grapevine. Knee lift, two more in front. And again. We got it. Now you wanna really travel on that first grapevine. Good, out. Pull. Let's get two more. We get our heart rates up again after that perceived exertion check. All right, we're gonna add on next time. Ready? Stay here, four taps front. It's down, two. Great find the other way. Knee side, two front, tap it. Good, and it's 
side. Knee up. Now four taps. Drop those arms. One more. We're going to keep building this combination and then add some variations. Next time, we're going to add on again. Tap it out. Now we're going to march eight counts in place. One, two, three, four. Now tap it out. Great fine. Here we go. Pull it up. Tap down. Now march eight counts. Now remember those four taps, alternating sides. Great fine. Here we go. This time we're going to add some direction. Travel front on these taps. Now march back. March in place. Tap it out. Great fine. Knee side. Knee front. Now tap it forward. March back. In place. Tap it out. That's the combination. Now we're going to do some variations. Let's have some fun with this. Woo. Tap it forward. All right. March back. Now march out. Out, out, in, in. Tap it out. Great fine. This time, as you come forward, kick it forward rather than tapping forward. Good work. March back. Out, out, in, in. Tap it out. Okay, you ready for another little change? Great fine. Take it up. Take it forward. Now we're going to do a little skip back if you want. Out, out, in, in. Now, Steve and Sharon will be doing the non-propulsion variation. So if you don't want to do that, watch them. Take it out. Skip back. Tap it out. All right, here's a change. Next time, one more. And kick it forward. And skip back. Now we're going to syncopate it out. Out, in. Tap, tap. What do you think? Here we go. Great fight. Take it up. Kick it forward. Dip. Skip back. Syncopate it. Out. In. Tap it up. Good. And up. And kick forward. And skip back. Okay, here comes one more change. Syncopate it. Now hold it here. Slow. Tap. Tap three quick. Yeah. Woohoo! Kick it forward. And back. Skip. Out. In. Tap. Slow. Slow. Quick. Yeah. Two more times through. Kick it forward. And it's back. Out. In. Slow. Slow. Quick. And out. That's it. This is our last time through. it out. Yes. How you guys doing? Good. How are you doing? Step touch. Step touch. Now we're going to take the arms side to side. Now we're going to go to the side two times. Take the arms out. Side. And over. And over. Now watch. New arms. The arms are bent. They reach. Hold. Going on, let's do four step touches. Circle the arm. One, two. Other side. Over. To the side. Now, this time we're going to make it change sides. Tap it out. Change sides. Go the other way. Woo! So you get three step touches. One tap out. Go the other way. Side. And side. Three step touches. Tap it out. And side. And side. Change the direction. Come to the corner. Come towards me. And back now. Face front. One, two, three. Other corner. Come towards the front corner of your room. And up. Good. Again. It's side. And side. And up. And other way. Side. And up. Okay. Hold it here. March it out. All right, remember that. That's part one of our combination. We're going on. We're going to march forward. Here we go. March in place. 
March back. In place. Good. March forward. So you get four forward, four back. Here's the arms. They go up and down. Now the legs go out, out, in, in. And up. Arms and legs together. And up. And out. You ready to go on? Okay, here's a fun new step. March forward and back right here. Forward and back. Now slowly turn the body. All right, let the arms work here. Now, when I tell you we're going to do four of these with the cha-cha at the end, here we go. It's one and two and three, a cha-cha to change sides. Cha-cha-cha, right here. Stay here. Let's cha-cha change sides. Cha-cha-cha, now two of these. Cha-cha-cha, here we go. Change sides, cha-cha. Change sides, now you're ready to put it together with that march. March forward, up. Out, out, in, in. Cha-cha, here we go. March back, back. Out, out, in, in. Cross over, cha-cha-cha. Cha-cha-cha, back, out, cross, and one more time, up, out, out, and cross, get ready, back, now you're ready to take it from the top, one more, cross, get ready, to the corner, and back, circle, the other side, now the good news is, is you always get two chances at everything, we'll do both sides. Take it up, come forward, up, out, out, in, in, cross, cha-cha, move it back, cross, and again, corner, up. and circle, other side, step together, step, Holding pattern again here. I know that you can't resist. Four more. Three. Catch your breath. Now we're gonna do two great binds this way. Ready? Do it again. Other way. That's it. Two great binds. Good. All right, you guys wanna add on? Okay, we're gonna stay down here. Lift the knee four times. That's it. Great find. And lift the knee. So you step on the outside leg, lift the inside knee. Add up. Add up. All right, next time I'm going to show you a variation. Watch. Half turn. And up. Watch it again. It's side. Half turn. Remember, this is optional. If you want to try it, go ahead. Out. If you don't want to do it, watch Steve and Sharon over here. Add up. Add up. And again, side. It's up. One more time. Out. Okay, we're going to go on. Stay here, tap it out. One leg at a time. Tap it out. Now let's do two taps. One, two. One. Push it off that leg. Let's add on to this. Two taps. Now slide side. Other side. Slide. Woo! Side. This is a real heart rate pumper. And up. Again. Push. And slide. And push. Two more times. Push. One more. Now stay here. Single pushes. Push. Punch front. That's it. Move forward four. One, two. Now move back with the knee lift. Move forward four punches. And tap. And four knee lifts. Back. Yes. One more.
more time now. You ready to put those two little combos together? What two combos? The double push. Here we go. Double slide. And double big slide. Forward. Woo. Back with the knee. One more time. Double. Slide. And out. And slide. Single push. Front. Two. Three. Four. It's back. Let's take it from the double grapevine. Half turn. And knee lift. You get another chance. Grapevine. Knee lift. Here's that double push. Ready. Push. Side slide. And push. Single push. It's front. 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 Knee lift. Back. Hold it here. March it out. Now, you guys ready to take it from the very top? Okay, that corner move. March it out. Let's take a breath in. Catch your breath because we're really going to go for it. Ready? Here we go. Woo. And it's up. Other way. It's side. And up. March forward. Up. Out, out, in, in. And cross. Cha-cha, other way. Out, out, in, in. Cross it over. Cha-cha-cha, now grapevine. Half turn, and knee lift. Other way, grapevine. Woo. And knee. Here's that double push. It's push, side, slide, make you really big. And push, and push it forward. One. Let's take it from the top last time. Go for it. Woo! Circle. Other way. Side. And it's a circle. March forward. Up. Out, out, in, in. Cross over. Cha, cha, cha. Move it back. Out, out, in, in. And cross. Cha, cha, cha. Grapevine. Let's march it out. Great job. But you're not done yet. Stay tuned for the cool down. Keep marching. Cool down is an important part of your workout. This is also a really good time to congratulate yourself on achieving your goal of regular exercise. Okay, you'll feel your heart rate start to slow down. Now, march three times with a clap and a tap on four. Right here. Tap it out. Now we're going to travel back with a little quarter turn. You go back, quarter turn, now tap out on the front. Do it again. Back, pull. Tap it out, back. Now one more on this last one. You're just going to keep walking and we're going to change sides. Just walk, 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 other leg. Back, quarter turn. Did you do it? Don't worry, we're going to stay on this leg. Pull it back, and out. Back, and out. One more, we're going to finish with a tap out and go into a grapevine side. Here we go, grapevine, now two little dips. Side dip, grapevine. And dip, grapevine, and dip. One more, let's put those two moves together. We're going to walk back, here we go. It's back, pull it out, front, grapevine, dip. Other leg, back, quarter turn. And side, right fine. Do it again, moving back. One, pull it back. Great fine. Dip. Last time. The step. Back. The music. And side. The step. Now we're gonna stay here. Keep going. Dip the it step. down. Now take your heel the front. Music. Right here. Take the it step. front. Now we're the gonna music. hold it right here. Take a little step back. 
sit wrist down. Rest your hands lightly on your thighs. Pull your toe back. We're stretching out all those muscles down the back of the legs. From your hip right down to your heel. Hold it four counts. And come forward. Lift your back heel up. Place the hands on the hips now. Tuck your hips under until you feel a stretch right through that hip flexor, through the front of the hip. Bend both knees slightly, just a little bit, and you feel that stretch go right down the front of the thigh. Make sure your abdominal muscles are pulled in tight. Hold it. And release it. Take this leg, kick it forward. Now make sure your toe is pointed on the floor. Bend your back knee and you're pressing your knee right against your calf muscle. And you should feel the stretch right through the front of the shin, through the front of the ankle. Hold it, relax those shoulders. And take this leg out, take a little step back. Ease into that hamstring stretch again. Now a little trick to get a little more hamstring stretch is to tip your tailbone back a little bit. To get a little more calf stretch, you can pull your toes up a little bit more. Your abs are in, inhale. And roll forward, lift the back heel up, hands on your hips. Tuck the hip under, feel that stretch right through the front of the hip. Bend the knees slightly. Hold it, your abs are in. The more you pull the abs in, the more stretch you'll feel through the front of that hip and thigh. And release it, kick the leg forward, point the toe, now bend your back knee and press it right against that front calf. And you wanna keep that toe pointed so you get the stretch right through the front of the shin, the front of the ankle. Hold it. And bring your feet together. Take a breath in. And exhale down. You did a great job. Now remember, you want to do an aerobic workout like this about two to three times a week. But it's also important for a balanced program to also include strength training and stretching. I'll see you next time. The music. The step. The music.